Further down the Malaprabha River is the village of Aihole, the cultural capital of the Western Chalukya dynasty from the 6th to 8th century. It is the cradle of Indian temple architecture, showing evolving stages in temple building. The 8th century Durga temple is iconic in its apsidal layout. A colonnaded ambulatory passage runs around the sanctum. Exquisite stone carvings give a glimpse into family life at that time. The door frame Lalata Bimba depicts Garud holding the tails of the serpents. The river goddesses Ganga and Yamuna are in the door jams. The Toran at the entrance is a first, harking back to the practice of working in wood. Pillars provided sculptors the opportunity to carve beautiful figures and motifs. In the apse, Shiva as the cowherd is carved lounging naturally against Nandi the bull. Nandi eyes the child playfully twisting his tail, a symbolic blend of the spiritual and the mundane. Exposed stonework shows the mortises used to fix the carved sandstone blocks. Vishnu in Var Avtar rescues Mother Earth from the underworld of snakes. Durga with awesome power slays a muscular Maheshasur. The 5th century Lad Khan temple with its log shaped blocks reminds of a wooden prototype. The projection over the Garbhagriha is a first and is the earliest precursor of the Shikara. Gaudar Gudi is older than the Lad Khan temple. It is among the earliest temples having a production path. This structure developed from the thatched hut concept. Inside, it explores cylindrical pillars. Structurally, stone is just a substitute for wood, even in the jointing. So that was ancient Aihole, where Indian temple architecture moved from wood into solid stone. We hope you enjoyed uh, viewing this. Don't forget to like and to subscribe and we'll see you on our next journey.